guys, it's Erica, and today I wanted to show you guys my new traveler's notebook. I got a bunch of questions from people about what I put in it and how I'm using it as a wallet, and I'll be totally honest, it's not pretty on the inside. It doesn't have like a ton of extra little cute things in it that people usually put in their traveler's notebooks. Mine is pretty basic. I just put some of these cute clips in it, mostly for the thumbnail for YouTube, but obviously this stuff doesn't go in my notebook, and I just have these cute paper clips this is VHL Designs, and this one is the Happy Plum, and then I figured this matched the color. So I will be keeping my Inkjoy pen here. This does not come with a pen loop, so it'll probably just stick on the outside just like that, which it fits pretty perfectly, so I'm not too concerned about it. But this is a pre-loved number one sugar icing Foxy Fix. It has the Foxy Fix on the back, it has um, a pencil embossed on the um, spine, and this is a reinforced spine, and it is a wide. Um, again, this is pre-loved. I got this from the Bumble Girl on Instagram. I was looking at the micro. I was gonna order a micro, and like with everything in it, it was gonna be like 60 bucks, and I was gonna get it um, brand new, but then like literally the same week that I was gonna order, the Bumble Girl posted a picture of this saying, hey, I'm selling this and I was like, you know what? It's a number one, which means it's passport size versus the micro, which is the number zero. It's slightly bigger. I can actually put passports in here, which my husband and I are going on a cruise with our little girl. Um, so the three of us will go and I'll be putting my pass our passports in here to take with us and continue to use it as a wallet. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and get the pre-loved one. I essentially got this for the same price I would have gotten for a micro. So I got this for a really good deal considering this is a wide and it's reinforced. Um, so anyway, this is simple. It doesn't have any pockets, but it does have four straps. One, two, three, four. And then this is actually an extra that she gave me. So if I wanted, I could add another notebook in here and double this up and just attach it right here. But let's go ahead and go through how I have this set up. First of all, when I got this, she did give me this notebook right here, um, which is from Coco Daisy. This, this was a freebie that came with um, the purchase. And she also gave me this Foxy Fix um, dashboard, which I don't have anything to put in it yet. I did have these Erin Condren cards, so I just stuck them in there for now. And then she actually had an adhesive pocket which she had stuck on the inside like a secretarial um, pocket. So there's that on the inside and then of course the dashboard. And then this is a Bookfell Studio notebook that I got on Etsy. This one has grid paper and it is stitched. It has the um, stitched notebook versus staples which I really like the stitching, it's really nice. Then this is a wallet um, insert which has a plastic zip pouch and then the other side has four card holders and then um, it came in a set of three so I've got one here two and then this is what an empty one looks like it's just got the zip pocket on one side and then two card holders here and then two on the other side so going back I went ahead and I made these little stickers one so that when I film like now, you guys can't see like the information on my card. Um, so it hides my credit card information and if like people just happen to be flipping through my notebook, it still keeps it all covered up. So I actually just made these so it has like, this is our main city card, my driver's license, then I have my debit card, this is my, um, my badge for work and then uh, the numbers were showing so I just took some sticker paper and just kind of stuck it in there. Then this is another Bookfell Studio notebook. Again, this is also grid paper, and same as the other one, it has the stitched binding. And then this is the back side of the wallet, which I just have some cash in here and some coins. Then I've got, um, I wrote company card, which I do have a company card with my actual company, but this is actually the card that I use for like my business, uh, my Etsy business, and then I made BB's RS card. And then I didn't have anything here, but I didn't want any information, my signature and the other information showing, so I just cut out some white sticker paper and just stuck it to the back, because um, I don't plan to put anything here. And then I forgot I had my company badge in here, so I have that covered up as well, which is some sticker paper. And this is another Bookfell Studio 
But this one is actually um, dotted paper. So if you guys wanna do like bullet journaling, and again, this has the stitching on it. So this came in a set of three, and these little wallets came in a set of three from Amazon, so I'll link that down below. And then in this pouch, I actually have um, like my insurance cards in here, and I didn't want my info to show, so I actually had this business card from Hummingbird Planner, and I was like, oh, this is perfect. It like covers everything, and it like folds, so I just stuck that on there. And then again, this is the empty one. And then this is again that notebook that I mentioned before that is included. So I will link um, the Bookfell Studio notebooks and then the Amazon card holders. They sell them in multiple sizes. This is the passport size. And I like them because they have like a little notch in the bottom so they fit perfectly in the elastics. And yeah, that is it. Pretty, pretty simple. People wanted to see it so there you go. Um, again, I got this pre-loved, so I got mine for a pretty good price, and I found it on Instagram, and I was hunting online on the Facebook group. The um, There's like a traveler's notebook, buy, sell, trade group, and then there's also a Foxy Fix selling, sell, buy, sell, trade group, and then I'm also on the My Foxy Fix group. So like that helped me find some sales too. So if you want some pre-loved ones, there are definitely ones out there. That was very simple. I do have um, any plan printable notebooks coming. So when those come, I'm gonna completely remove the ones that I have, these Bookfell Studio ones. Cause I mean, I'll use them and I'm definitely gonna continue using them but I wanna swap them out and put my Annie Plans printables in here. She's actually printing and cutting them for me <laughs> because as a shop owner, she does that for shop owners when she does swaps. Instead of us buying her printable files, she actually will um, make the notebooks for us. So she's making them for me so I don't have to make them myself, which is really awesome. So um, when I get those, I'll do a haul and then I'll show you what they look like as an update to this. But for now, this is my, my love, my pre-loved number one Foxy Fix wide and sugar icing. So excited, so happy, I love it. It was very well taken care of and it smells so nice and new and I'm just really excited about this thing. I'm probably gonna buy more. So anyway, that is it for my quick walkthrough. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.